Hi YouTubers, I'm going to show you just really quickly how to take your unlocked iPhone 3GS and get it working on 5.1.1 without um, changing your baseband and then you just unlock it again and it works untethered unlike the 5.1. Everything that you're going to need is going to be at redmondpie.com R-E-D-M-O-N-D-P-I-E dot com. Um, you're going to use Ponage Tool 5.1.1 and download the stock 5.1.1 which you can also find a link to from, from Redmond Pi. Then, once you've downloaded everything, you need a Mac for Ponage Tool to work. You're going to mount the image, open Ponage Tool. You want everything in the same folder. Mine are just in my download folder. Open. Tell it OK. Select iPhone 3GS, Expert Mode. Browse for iPhone software. And here it is in the same folder. You want to make sure that you're grabbing the one. I've already done this. I'm not going to do it again. But you want to make sure that you're grabbing the correct one, which is not the custom restore. Open. It'll work. I'm going to add winter board. General. want it to activate the phone if you're unlocking. I didn't re-enable any functionality. I have my root partition size at 1.244 1244 megabytes. And if you look, I'm not enabling the baseband update because I'm on an unlockable baseband already. Go, go. And I'm going to tell it to build. It's going to ask me about saving it. I'm going to save it right in the same folder. And if you look, it says custom restore. Save. Right now it's telling me that there's already one in this because I've already done it. So I'm going to tell it to replace. And it's going to build. As soon as it finishes stitching the hacked software together. It's going to tell me to connect my iPhone to the computer. Then once I do that, it's going to help me get it into some kind of recovery DFU mode. You just follow the instructions exactly and your phone will go into um, it'll be prepared to accept the custom software. Then you open iTunes. You click Option Restore Ask me for my password here. And then follow the instructions to restore the custom software to your iPhone. You want to make sure 
when you're looking in that folder, when you're browsing for the custom software, that you actually select the custom software. As soon as you do all that and the phone reboots, all you need to do is open Cydia, search for Ultra Snow, and the latest Ultra Snow is I think 1.2.7. Select it, install it, your phone will respring, and your unlock should be working great. Thanks. Have fun, YouTube.